Hi, I'm Governor Tom Wolf. This year, my administration worked to build the policies, initiatives, and working relationships that create and sustain jobs that pay in Pennsylvania. We've seen some success in our job market already. Did you know that the record high for the total number of jobs in Pennsylvania occurred in October of this past year? And in November, Pennsylvania surpassed our pre-recession high in the labor force employment count. This puts our state in an expansion period. One way, one way we achieved this was through the work of the governor's action team, an experienced group of economic development professionals who report directly to me and who work with businesses that are considering locating to or expanding in Pennsylvania. In 2015, the governor's action team completed 58 such projects, which in turn created over 4,500 new jobs and helped retain over 11,000 positions. And we plan to continue to do just that, continue to expand our workforce, our businesses, and the successes of Pennsylvania's hardworking middle-class families. Since my inauguration, I joined members of my cabinet to travel around the state on my Jobs That Pay tour. We made stops in every corner of the state, Erie, Scranton, Johnstown, State College, Philadelphia. We talked with business owners, industry leaders, and hardworking Pennsylvanians about what else we can do to help them thrive. I am proud of what we've accomplished this year. In September, I signed an executive order solidifying my administration's commitment to improving the participation of small and diverse businesses, businesses owned by minorities, women, LGBT community members, veterans, disabled persons, in state government contracting, and in the Commonwealth's overall economy. We made many exciting job announcements. 500 new jobs in Northampton County, almost 200 new jobs at the Philadelphia Navy Yard, 200 new jobs in Pike County, and this list goes on and on. I'm excited to see what the new year brings for Pennsylvania. I pledged to create jobs that pay across our Commonwealth, and I plan to continue to do just that.